Welcome back. Well, who doesn't love a homemade soft pretzel? It's a great snack. And joining us on the four o'clock show, Tessa and Rodney Burns, owners of Rolling in the Dough and their specialty pretzels. Thanks so much for joining us. Good to have you on the show. Thanks for having us. Yeah, this is wonderful. And these are some big pretzels. First of all, I don't know that I've seen any this the size before, Rodney. That's those are some great looking pretzels. It's one of our signatures, they are large soft pretzels. So <laughs> we want you to get your money's worth. Now what goes into, now that one's a really large one behind oh, it. It is. <laughs> now what goes into this, Tessa, as far as making these? Uh, obviously you all make your own dough or how does that work? We do. Um, he's actually the, the person to that makes the dough. <laughs> okay, so what's so we the have secret? A lot of, uh, well, I know you don't want to share your secret exactly. So yeah, we exactly, do have a secret recipe uh, that comes from uh, our friends down in Florida. We uh, traveled down there uh, to Heavenly Soft Pretzels and we uh, got the ingredients from them and it's a family recipe. It's a mixture of flour, sugars and salts and different things and yeast and uh, we whip all that up together and make some soft pretzels. Okay, great. Now, are you putting anything together over there today? We are. Oh, We're yeah. going to try to make you a few today, if that's okay, all right. Okay, great. So, this is our salted pretzel here. Uh, we all pre-salt these. Um, we can do a salt and butter pretzel. We also have garlic parmesan and we're going to make some of those for you. We do Ooh, several different types good. of <laughs> toppings and we have several different dips. Um, we do the cinnamon sugars and here we just left carnival season. Right. And we actually have a Mardi Gras style king cake pretzel that oh, we will do today. Oh, that you today. put a little icing on there? Or we cream do. Cheese We're going to have some something? cream cheese icing on here in just a little bit. And uh, she seasons them all up this for us. This is our salted butter. Oh, now There's that a looks salted good. Butter. Salted butter. Mm. She'll make a garlic parmesan. A nice, now. simple salted butter. Is that the best seller, probably? It is one of the best sellers um, that we have. Also, we have. Uh, one of our biggest uh, here lately, like I said, is the Mardi Gras king cake pretzel. The cinnamon sugar sells really well, but depending on the area that we are in, uh, when we get more towards Louisiana, they really like the garlic parmesans. Right. Uh, seems like everybody in South Mississippi likes the sweet ones. So. Uh, okay. And what are you putting the together? The king cake. So this she's making a uh, a king cake one here that we call it. Uh, we do different. That was a cinnamon sugar that she's putting on there, and then she sure. will actually top it with a cream cheese. Wow. That will go around it. Then we're going to put all the different <laughs> colored sugars and stuff on here. So if you have a sweet ah. tooth, this is the one that you want. Oh, very yeah. sweet. Now, I know this came out because of Mardi Gras, but do you think you might keep a variation of this one on the menu of some kind? So we have, uh, we have uh, brought them up at different times of the year. Uh, had people tell us that this should be our signature pretzel. You can't find these anywhere else. So uh, Yeah, that actually very sweet. looks kind of like a king cake. Yes, it does. <laughs> That's amazing. And tell me a little bit about um, where you're located and how long you've been in business. And so we're located out of Picayune, Mississippi. Uh, we have uh, a food trailer that we do different events with. We like to do fairs and festivals and we like to do private events and then we will do di different pop-ups here and there, farmers markets and things like that. So. What gave you the idea of this in particular? It sounds like you had a connection with someone else that was doing this too. We did. Uh, after the COVID shutdown, uh, I was in the, I've been in the medical field still and we were shut down for a while during COVID, but uh, it seemed like everything was shut down but the food industry. So uh, we uh, decided that we, I've always liked to cook. I've been, uh, my mother was a great cook and, and she taught me a lot and I decided to cook. And we had some friends down in Florida that, uh, like I said, they're heavenly soft pretzels. Uh, Alan and Tammy Zypher okay. and uh, we have been friends with them for a long time and they kind of got us into it so there's only them and us well, it's that we quite, know. Yeah quite a success story it's rolling in the dough in Picayune and Rodney and Tessa Burns uh, thanks so much for sharing it looks delicious I don't know which kind to try first. Uh, I don't know. They do you want savory or do you want sweet? <laughs> We've got them. I'll have to figure it out. <laughs>